Allen in Highlands Park, New Jersey writes to me, Paul, you of course prefer DSD to PCM, but there are complexities in editing DSD, forcing you to use DXD. I have to assume DSP processing would use PCM as the editing uh, for DSP because it would be too much in just DSD. Uh, am I correct? And what are your thoughts on this? And if I'm correct, and if it's possible, do you think you'd like DSD better if it was DSD based? Ah, I think I understand the question. Pure DSD is definitely my favorite to capture. And everything we do at Octave Records for certain is captured in DSD. When we started Octave Records, kind of here, this is uh, Gus Skinnis's mastering area, we used the Sonoma system, which is 1x DSD, which is 64 times the 44.1 sample rate of CD. So we call it uh, DSD 64, that's single rate DSD. Excellent sounding, just terrific. And that's how we started. Now we have, and everything we did in the Sonoma system was then mixed in analog and then put back to DSD. So we didn't use DXD. It never went to PCM. DSD to analog, back to DSD. And that sounded great. And the octave releases that we produced, many, many octave releases, I'm very proud of those. Those are excellent. What we have discovered, now moving from the Sonoma system to at the new studio at Octave Records, the Pyramix system is that properly configured DXD, which is PCM. I mean, it's just a fancy name for PCM that is running at 352.8 kilohertz, which is, uh, help me out here, I'm not so great at math. So 44.1, 88.2, and then, yeah, and 352.8. How many jumps is that? Four or five. Okay. <laughs> That's what DXD is. It is easy to edit in. It sounds great. And what's interesting to me is the Sonoma files that were recorded originally in the Sonoma system at 1x DSD, 64 times uh, the 44.1 sample rate, sound so much better when we put them into the Pyramix system, mix them in DXD, and then back again to DSD. When you compare the two, it's, it's, there's not that, oh boy. Going the way that we did it from Sonoma to analog and then back again is definitely not as good as what we're currently doing, which is even, even with the original Sonoma files, going to the new DXD system that we have built around the Pyramix and, and then out. We have, if you remember our Gabriel Mervine album, one of our best-selling albums ever, Say Something. You look it up on octobrecords.com. Great album. We sold out of that a couple of times, and they're still clamoring for it. Great album recorded completely on the Sonoma system, then to analog, and then back to DSD or to PCM, depending on how you listen to it. I've remastered that on the DXD system in Pyramix. Oh, we're going to have a, a, a remaster release on that. Wait till you hear it. It's stunning. So the question is, if everything stayed in DSD and you could magically do everything, uh, yeah, I think that would even be better. No question about it. And we actually know how to do that, but I don't know technically whether we can pull it off. Because to do that, we'd have to move away from 1-bit DSD to 3, 4, 5-bit DSD. And that, running at 11 megahertz, whoo! <laughs> We'd have to build a whole new digital audio workstation. So maybe someday, but yeah. Right now, what we're doing is state of the art and it sounds glorious. Love it, okay. Thanks for the question. Take it easy.